I don't tell you. I get that it's the big game, okay? But I already promised Maggie that I'd stop wasting my time and our money on these contests and sweepstakes, so. You said it yourself, Tim. This is the big game. Not just the big game, the biggest game. It's done, guys, okay? Anyway, I haven't gambled or entered a contest in over a month anyway. A month? You're letting her change you, bro. Big mistake. Oh, isn't that the pot calling Kettle Black? Was that a race joke? What? No! Tim, you have racist friends? He's not racist. I'm not racist. I have mad black friends. Oh, you have them? Like, they're yours. What? No, Tim, tell him I'm not racist. I told him. Enough! Will you two shut the hell up? Tim, you're dripping all over the place here, bro. It's a fucking flood down here. But luckily, you have someone like me as your best friend. And yeah, your, your regular friends are, are good too. But me, as your best friend? them as your regular friends it is our obligation to make sure that you're living out your life's purpose your dream it is our responsibility that you take advantage of the opportunity of a lifetime within the lifetime of the opportunity so you can see our concern when my best friend and their regular friend says no to the biggest game of the biggest sport in the biggest country in the world we're not actually the biggest country though Shut the fuck up, Uncle Fester. <laughs> Bottom line is this. You have the chance to live the dream that every man living in this wonderful country would give up his left nut for. The chance to attend one of the most legendary, renowned, illustrious events in the history of mankind. I'm not gonna fucking sit here and let you pass this up because you told your fiance you wouldn't. Yeah, bro, you're not even married yet, man. Bottom line is this, bro. You're going to enter the contest, and you're going to live the life you are destined to live. The life of a champion. Damn, Vin. Now that was dope, man. I'm impressed. I watch a lot of Tony Robbins. No oh, shit. <laughs> yes, shit. They return a punt to the 30-yard line, so your final touchdown drive will start at the 30. Their 30. Pretty big fat. It's the big game. It's the biggest game. The opportunity of a lifetime within the lifetime of the opportunity. Welcome to Finger Food Frenzy. Hey. Oh wait, you guys must be with Albert. And how would you know that? Just ignore him. Just trust the table, thanks. The tides don't command the ship. The captain does. Right this way. In his head, he just pulled your zipper down with his teeth. Shut up. <laughs> don't worry, I'll zip it up when I'm done. Oh! Look who we have here. It's Drippy Goldberg and our good friend Mel Dripson. You have problems, Ben. Yeah, I have a new 60-inch problem hanging up on my bedroom wall. And just the other day, a $5,000 problem came in the mail. Now those are the type of problems I got. I want to blow me. What? The host, he heard what you said about the zipper and the teeth, and he wants to blow me. <laughs> Are you serious? Wait a minute. Blowjobs? Guy? <laughs> what are you guys talking about? Listen guys, I don't have time to hear about your tales from the drip. So can you tell me why you had me come out here in such short notice? Because I got a quarter of the finest purple kush 
and a sexy dime piece waiting for me to go home and stick it in. All right, Vin. Honestly, I couldn't believe it when I saw it come in the mail, oh. but yeah, yeah, no. I won. You lucky son of a bitch! Yeah. I knew it. I told you to enter, and now you won? Bro, this is huge. I can't wait to go. There's so much to do. It better be a direct fight, too. I fucking hate layovers. So whoa, whoa, whoa. What makes you think he's taking your ass anywhere? Exactly. Tim and I hang out the most. Uh, I'm gonna pump the brakes on that one real quick. I've known him the longest. Way longer than anyone else at this table has known him. Who cares? Tim and I have lunch together every day. Just yesterday, gave me his coastal. Oh, it's coastal, huh? <laughs> Should be disqualified for that right there. When we were kids, this guy gave me his bike helmet. Risked his own life for me. Didn't even have one for himself. Hey, Drip Van Winkle. When you and OJ Gibson over here are done jerking each other off, I'll put it real simple for you guys. You guys don't know the fucking difference between a goal post and a Facebook post. I love football. I'm his best friend. I'm the coolest out of any of us. I'm going with him. End of story. Well, aren't we lucky it's not up to you, Vinny? It's up to Tim. Yeah. Who's going with you, Tim? Who's coming with me? Who is coming with me? Albert, so. Hey, <laughs> what's up, Eddie? No, no, just uh, working on collage for Tim. Yeah, yeah, he's been having a tough time with Maggie and trying to figure out who to take. It's, I don't envy his position. Hold on, oh, girls. <coughs> No, I'm sorry, so what's going on, Betty Bumpkin? No, I said bumpkin, not blump. What's a blumpkin? What? No, 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 you can't be serious, that's disgusting. No, 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 I don't wanna know how you know. Just discuss it for another day. I'll talk to you later. All right. Ugh. There's a word for that? What's going on? You tell me. I kind of figured this was your way of saying I'm sorry for this uh, contest. I wish I had done all this. Whoa, Rich, do you knock much? <laughs> Not in case of emergencies. What the fuck is he doing here? What's the emergency? Running from your wife again, Reggie? Hell no. <laughs> what the fuck, Tyrese Dripson? You have to ruin everything? I'm prepared this awesome night for Tim and Maggie. Wait a minute, you did this? Uh, yes. <laughs> I wanted you guys to see how great I think you are. Thanks, bud. You're welcome. It's fresh chicken. Oh, hey, Al. Come on in. Thanks, best friend. <laughs> what the fuck is that shit? I made it to signify our best friendship, dick. Oh, Al, it's cute. It's cute. Thanks, Max. Yeah, it's really thoughtful, oh. man. I'm, I'm happy you like it, because I know you've been having some inner conflict, you know, with everything going on. No pressure, I just want you to know you're appreciated. Hey, I set up this whole awesome night for you guys. Don't you guys see the fucking candles? Finn, I appreciate it. We both appreciate it. You know, we appreciate everything you guys are doing for us. You're all my best friends. I mean, this is crazy. 
I prepared this meal, I play the music, this is fucking bullshit! Hey Tim, remember that time we went trick-or-treating and there's only three G.I. Joe costumes and I had to get the bear? <laughs> yeah, I made a cute bear, but you made a mean G.I. Joe, buddy. Thanks, dude. Damn Forget right. that. Hey Tim, I forgot to tell you, man, when I get paid next week, I'm taking you to the Hall of Fame. What? Seriously? So this is seriously a huge decision you have to make now. Thank you.